No, it looks like it's just side cannons. It looks like an easier version of the, the last guy, actually, to be honest. Come on, boy. One punch. Ugh. What? What the? <laughs> Hey everyone, how's it going? My name's MBR. Welcome to The Last Leviathan. It just came out for early access. It was Steam Greenlit, actually. Um, and this game caught my eye. It kind of has this really nice uh, environment about it. And then also, it kind of has like this mix of games at the moment. So it's it's obviously, it's like Besiege in a way. Um, you're here building ships in the water, trying to battle, you know, other pirate ships and monsters and such. Um, but it also has like a Subnautica feel because there is exploration in the game. There is a world that you can go find new things. Um, they haven't implemented the actual voyage part yet, which I believe is where all the creatures and stuff are. There are no creatures in this game yet. It's all just you building stuff and using it, trying to kill ships, and hopefully it doesn't get wrecked in the process. So uh, I'm gonna go into the um, Battle Seas version, which is you can actually go and do challenges, you level up and you get all these stars, and it increases in difficulty as you progress as well. So. We're gonna do that because it's the most fun, I would say, probably. I haven't tried all the modes yet, but I feel like if I was just out in the middle of nowhere doing nothing, um, I would I would go mad. I have to be fighting something. I have to kill some pirates. I have to be doing something progressive. Um, also, I tried to make a ship. This thing sucked. So you have a whole bunch of things to choose from. In the movement tabs, you can do rudders, propellers, or sails. Uh, the sails are really hard to control because you have to actually go with the wind and such. Um, and you know, I just rather have a huge propeller on the back of my thing. And then also, um, there's a whole bunch of weapons. So I've tried none of these because every single ship that I make breaks into little bitty pieces. So hopefully I can finally make one that will actually withstand the, the ocean and I can actually move around. So I'm gonna build something real quick and uh, we'll see how it goes. So I'm building my ship. <laughs> I made it backwards. <laughs> All right, gonna redo this. So I tried to make the most basic piece of crap boat possible. Um, it's pretty much just a dinghy with a bunch of uh, mortars on the front. So I'm gonna set sail. It's landed, that's a good sign, but it's, is it gonna move for look forward? I don't, okay. Well, it's good at, fuck. All right, maybe that will be a little bit more balanced. I, it doesn't look like it. It doesn't. It just wants to do backflips. I think it might be this keel thing underneath. I think that's like really, really heavy. I pretty much just made a submarine though. That's a, congratulations, Mike, you did it. Come on, stay steady. Keep it, st oh God, okay. I'm at half speed now. Just gotta be, be cool, man. Just gotta be cool. I don't have a rudder on my, s <laughs> please, for the love of God, just let me, did I make it? Okay, I'm moving around. Uh no, come on. I think we're we're stable. For the time being, we are stable. I'm gonna destroy this. I don't know what this even is, but I'm gonna destroy it. Yes, there we go. I flipped my boat. <laughs> this is like the practice thing right here. This isn't even an enemy. I'm just practicing. There we go. Burning it to a crisp. The rum barrels are dead now. Okay, move on to bigger things. So I think my plan is I'm gonna find some pirate ships. I'm gonna use my mortar. You can actually go into first person mode. You click on the weapon, and I'm just gonna use my mortar and then try to uh, just, you know, fire cannon shots and hope for the best. And if they get close, then I'll burn them. I'll burn them alive. Smooth sailing now. This is actually pretty good. I might make my ship a little bit more wide so it's a bit more stable, because right now it's kind of like wobbly, but at the time being, we're okay. I might be speaking too soon. Okay, slow down a little bit. If you wanna be really fast, you have to have a lot of weight to your ship too, as weird as that sounds, because you need to be grounded if you go off a, a wave and flip over, then you're gonna die instantly, which really sucks. Got some islands over here. I'm sure that when the game is fully released, which I'm actually already excited for, there's gonna be a lot of creatures to explore, kind of like Subnautica in a way. But uh, that's the whole point of this game is the Leviathan. It's a huge creature. Um, it was in the trailer, I believe. Maybe that's just the Kraken, but if you guys wanna see the trailer, you should definitely go check it out. Uh, it looks pretty amazing from what I saw. which made me buy the game. Let's look at that logic. All right, so I think I might actually have to kill that uh, that rum barrel ship thingy over there. Seems sad, because it's defenseless. Like, it can't do anything against me, but I'm just gonna try to kill it anyways, I guess. Boom! You would think, oh, okay, so yeah, I am damaging it now. Oh, there we go. It's starting to deteriorate. Oh, it's done. Battle one, done. 
that wasn't a battle, but okay. Uh, we're gonna try to, oh, what is that? Little bell. I found the grave of the dead peer. Go back, fight him again. Okay, so you can go back to the bells and like fight them again, I guess. So uh, I'm gonna try to find another pirate, or well, an actual pirate, instead of just a little tiny rum ghost ship. And uh, try to fire some motors at them and uh, try to kill. I already see him. I already see him out there, he's gonna die. Strategy is I'm just gonna go slowly, shoot some mortars, get in close, and then burn them. Finish them off with the flamethrowers. Up. It's just like basketball, just like basketball. So he has, whoa, he has like a lot of armor. So it is like a Viking ship. That's pretty freaking sweet looking actually. You know what? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna use the flamethrowers. Right off the bat, gonna use my flamethrowers. Just like that. He's getting messed up. Getting messed up from the fire. I just came up with a tooltip that said, uh, some ships won't fire until fired upon. I don't think this guy has a choice. So I think that if I hit him from the side now, I don't believe I see, yeah, I don't see any weapons. I'm just gonna go over to his side and uh, go around his armor there. Cause he has a lot of armor on the backside. There we go, battle two, one. We did it. <laughs> that still didn't seem like a battle. I stole one of his cubes. It's part of me now, it's gone. Okay, well, onto the third one. More pirate ships to be destroyed. Hopefully I'll find an actual battle here soon. Uh, that'd be kind of nice. Oh, wait, oh, that's another bell over to the right. Okay, so I see the next pirate ship over there straight ahead. This time I'm gonna try to use my mortar shell, I think. See if I can topple him or something with it. I, I see the pirates in the distance there. Surrounded by the blue waters. I don't even know what I'm doing. Let's go mess him up. He already sees me. I've been spotted by the pirate ship. He, oh, he has a weapon. I see a gun on the front end of his ship actually. So now it's my time to strike. It's not gonna make it, is it? Nope. Oh, he has a side gun. Oh my God, I just rammed. Am I? Oh, I'm alive, I'm alive, okay. So God, these, this ocean is messing up my view right now. I can't really understand where I'm at. So I'm gonna, one of my guns were destroyed. Oh shit. Okay, well, dang. I'm gonna stop here for a sec. Use my mortar, boom. Come on, get to him, come on. I just gotta stay behind him. Hopefully one more shot will do the trick. Oh, there we go. Battle three, one, the Kraken wakes. I didn't think that they implemented creatures yet. So that might just be like a warning sign if it does happen. But as far as I know, there's no creatures in this game yet. So, and that'll be really fun once you can like actually defeat Krakens and shit and, and find the last Leviathan. So he has a front mounted cannon right now. Hopefully I'll burn it away before he can turn around and kill me. Ooh, he's getting messed up. That's the thing. If you don't have something on the side of your ship, and I get lodged into the side of your ship, you're gonna get messed up. Burn, baby. Burn. Okay, I'm just gonna use my mortar while shooting him with my uh, flamethrower. Hopefully it doesn't damage me though. Oh, oh, I toppled him. Done. Done, done, done. I don't know if I can repair my ship. I don't think I can actually. Maybe if I dock again, what will docking do? Oh, shit. I think I reset it, <laughs> damn it. So I'm gonna name that ship the, uh, the basic bitch. All right, guys, this one I, I deem the Crab Rammer. Um, it's It's got a bunch of crab fists on the front so I could just, you know, get my enemies while they're least expecting it. But before I can deem it seaworthy, I gotta actually see if it can stay, you know, steady or whatnot. How is it? Is it okay? Hey, this seems to be like pretty decent actually. Cool. Now to ram some people. It's actually the more stable ship I've had this entire time, <laughs> to be honest. Oh God, oh God, oh God, spoke too soon, spoke too soon. Stop that, stop it now. See, being on top of the ocean, I'm not too scared. Being below the ocean, that's where it gets scary. That's why Subnautica, I, I just get kind of freaked out. Well, I guess we can take this time to explore the islands. Also, in the full release, or at least in the trailer, it showed also like towns you can go to and stuff. So you could probably even dock there. Whoa, I got a big speed boost for some reason. Um, so yeah, there's gonna be a lot of exploration. This is kind of just like a little sandboxy mode in a way, I guess. By the way, guys, I have Besiege. I've, I've just never actually made a video on it. If you guys wanna see some of that as well. Oh, shit. Okay, if you wanna see some of that, just let me know as well. I like Legos. I used to I used to play with Legos all the time when I was a kid. I love to build things. And usually they don't work because I never look at the manual. I just take it, toss it, and go for the plastic pieces. But uh, you know, that's how you, that's how you learn your way as a man. No longer our boy, I guess, with Legos. <laughs> All right, yep, I see a pirate ship. Full full speed ahead, boys. Full speed, come on. If my freaking driver wasn't drunk, that'd be nice. That'd be great. Can't quite tell what he has on his boat yet, but no matter. Oh God, almost front flipped. 
Okay, just maybe sneak attack him until he least expects it. Also, I'm going against the wind, I believe. Here we go. I've been spotted. I've been... Does he have side guns? I think he might have two different sets of side guns. So if I take him from the front... Oh, shit. But he has a... He has a ramming rod, too. I'm just going to go for it. Just going to go for it. Bah! This is... Oh, yeah. Take that. Eat it. Eat it. Oh, yeah. You like it. You like being mounted like that. Okay. This is... This is a very awkward... We're butt to butt. Very awkward battle. Okay. Now, full speed ahead. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Get him while he least expects it. Come on. Ram him. Ram him. That's so anticlimactic. I don't understand. Oh, no. Oh, no. Eh. Yeah. Split in half. There we go. That was awesome. <laughs> I just cut his chip in half like butter. These are my butter knives right here on the side, by the way. All right. I guess we know who the best pirate is here in, this, in the sea. Probably not me. I wonder if I can wall ride. Let me try this out. Land ho! All right. Nice. I just lost a piece of, I lost a rudder. I actually think that my butter knives are uh, stopping my, my crab hammers from hitting. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to, how many resources can I use? So I'll get rid of these things. I'll put some more blocks on top of here. Put even more crab hammers. Put a little, little peephole in the front. There we go. Got my little, Got my little crab hammer guy. Hopefully it's not too front heavy. Oh, I think it might be. Oh shit, okay. Not very stable, but we'll see how it does. I might be able to just one punch people. That's what I should have named it. I should have named it the one punch. I freaking love that show. Super funny, super original anime. Like I haven't seen anything like it. I think rumor is spreading of my, my battles and the pirates are afraid of me. I haven't seen one in a while now. This looks so menacing. <laughs> <laughs> just a ship with crab hands at the front. Just so ridiculous. I thought that was a shark at first. Kind of looks like a mouth, a little eyeball. But it's a rock. Just a rock. Oh, I see him. I see him out there. Thought it could hide from me in the shallow waters? No way. Crab loves shallow waters. Actually, I don't think they do. <laughs> Alright, what kind of weapons you got over there? I see a side cannon. I see a torch. I can't really tell what's on it, though. But I do see a side cannon, and I think there's a front ram as well. Uh, no, looks like it's just side cannons. It looks like an easier version of the, the last guy, actually, to be honest. Come on, boy. One punch. Ugh. What? What the? <laughs> what the hell was that? No. Why did my ship just fold like that? That was messed up. Maybe if I try it one more time. Here, let me try it one more time. Let's see here. Maybe it was just a fluke. Maybe <laughs> Or it just had way too much momentum. That was ridiculous. It's gonna ram you just a tiny bit, just a little bit. It did it again, what the hell? Oh, oh, I barely made it, okay. So I'm, I have rotting wood planks on the side of my boat. Uh, it'll have to do for now, whatever. Hopefully this'll uh, keep it from folding in half like that. That's just sad that I have this massive crab hand on the front and then it keeps on just folding in half. I'm a suicide bomber pretty much is what it is right now. I don't even know how to do damage with these things though is the thing. It's like, I think I might have to be going like full speed. So maybe if I just go back and forth, like run away and go for another, another take and... Whoa, that was close. Okay, here we go. Charging time. Charging time, big boy. Eh. That was stupid. Oh shit. Oh shit, oh shit. He just wrecked me. Okay, crab hammer, don't fail me. Come on, let's do this, big boy. Come on. Ugh. Yeah, this this isn't gonna work. This is not gonna work, you guys. Just kill me now. Get it over with. Let me let me have a Viking burial. Oh, I got rid of rid of his rudders actually. Oh oh, his other rudder's gone. He has no control now. Now I can just back up and go forward again. Okay, let's see how this works out. I might actually be able to defeat him. Should I just let him list off into sea? He can't control what he's doing. Like, he's just going off there just like, fuck this. <laughs> I'm just going to surrender, boys. It's over. It's done. The crab hammer, it, it's not as effective as I thought it would be. <laughs> kind of want to try this really expensive mortar. Uh, just right there on the front. All right. Mortar's there. Armor plating on the front. So I'm really, really weak from the sides and back. So hopefully they don't, like, just go around me like I did with that last guy. All right. I've been spotted by the pirate ship. I have my mortar shell in hand. Well, not, you know what I mean. Here we go. Okay, just 
just gonna aim. How far can I shoot that thing, by the way? Whoa, that thing is powerful. I can be way out here. There we go. Oh, these are getting so close to him. Come on, just hit him. Get it. Come on. Unless he turns, he can't actually shoot me, so I'm not in that bad of a position right now. Overshot that one. Oh, oh, it hit. Was that a one hit? Wait a second. <laughs> that, that did so much damage to him. Holy crap. Okay. Oh, oh, that was almost it. Come on. Take that. A freaking pirate son of a gun. Pillaging and plundering. Who do you think you are? Get rid of his weapons first. Let's see if I can make that happen. Ha! I am wrecking his ship right now. Mortars are amazing. Oh, it's gone. Wow. Okay. So it took like three direct hits, I feel like. That was ridiculous. All right. I see the first ship that actually looks like it could be a pirate ship. It has a sail on top. Let's go check it out. All right. Let's give him a, let's give him a little bit of a warning shot here first. Pirate ship. Ye foe or friend? Probably foe. I mean, I doubt I have any friends here. Whoa, his ship is like a catamaran. That's awesome. Why didn't I think of that? Oh, how did that not hit? How did that not freaking hit? I'm behind him now. Got him circled. Got him circled. Got him circled. Come on. Oh my god. Okay. I just need to knock out his sail or his rudder so he can't actually move because he has side cannons again. All these ships have these freaking side cannons. They love them for some reason. There we go. Knocked out the side of his ship. Oh, that was like, oh my God. This thing is amazing. I'm, I mean, this is, you wouldn't think that this is a powerful ship if you saw it. You would look at the ship and say, who went to Ikea and who didn't use the manual? Okay, but I am three shotting ships. Three shots, done. Fast, you mates. I be the SS Ikea. <laughs> Pirate Magnus Bjorn no life. <laughs> he has no life. He's just a pirate. Okay, here we go. Gotta slow down. Gotta fire off some warning shots. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Oh, my. Well. I surrender. He wrecked my mortar on the first shot. That kind of sucked. I'm gonna go in. Uh, I'm gonna try and use this now uh, against that guy. I feel like... If I use my flamethrowers, and I have two of the top tier ones, by the way, um, it might be be pretty good. I don't know. Oh, oh, he's trying to turn. He's trying to turn. Don't want to get on his sides there. Oh, 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 no, no, no. Slow down. Okay, slow down. Oh, God. Oh, God. Here we go. Here we go. Locked in. Burn him alive. Burn this guy. He just body slammed me. God damn. Come on. No. Son of a bitch. This is awkward. It's gonna burn it from the backside, I guess. Yep, there we go. There we go. There we go. Can't beat this, can you? I burned everything on his ship. There we go. Oh. <laughs> All right, now I wanna try these triple mini cannons. See what those are like, because I feel like a lot of the ships I was versing are using those. It kind of looks like a monster from the front. Like it has nine eyes and a bunch of teeth. <laughs> I am the Leviathan. All right, we're coming on the, I think this is number nine actually. Um, I don't know how many there are. It might just keep on going and it might just keep on getting harder and harder. But uh, Ivar the Tenacious, give me your clams. Oh, he's stuck. Get him, back up a little bit and get him. Oh God, oh no, this is bad. Bad news. What's what's wrong with my ship? Why is it stuck going looking down? What the heck? Huh, I just ran one of his guns off. That was awesome. I am now a submarine, I guess. I don't know what's happening. All my guns have shifted for Why why is it doing that? What the heck? Okay, um I guess we have to surrender. All right. Well, whatever. So I went back to what works, you know, my little dinghy with a huge mortar on top. I feel like that's the most effective thing I've, I've had so far. All right, we're coming up on that. Uh, Johan, I don't remember his name. Boom, right in his side. There we go. There we go. <laughs> this thing is awesome. There you go. Done. He's over. Yeah, but just a bunch of cubes. Oh, and a bell. And a bell. All right, guys, let's see what the SS Ikea can do against this uh, level 10 pirate. Gunsroli Thorarsen. His ship looks awesome. I mean, mine is obviously the better one, but not everyone can make the best 
ship ever, you know? It's, there's some that are awesome and some that are just the best, naturally. No, never run away. Never surrender. Never. Uh-oh. Gonna back up now. Just a little bit. I'm not surrendering. I'm just back... Just backing up. What's what's wrong with my ship? Oh, I lost the back end of it. Cool. Um, I guess... I guess I'm forced to fight now. Guess it's just... Yep. Right on his deck. Right on his poop deck. Oh, and it's done. It's over. <laughs> How did I win that? I should be dead right now. Oh, well. All right, guys. And that was the first 10 pirates. Thanks for joining me on this voyage we have here. Really excited for the full game to release when they have all the Krakens and all the, the sea life and towns and stuff you can go voyage to. Um, I don't know if they're going to implement like quests and stuff. I don't know if they're going to go that into detail. But they're definitely going to make some new environments. And uh, it looks really cool. So go check it out on Steam. Right now, it just got greenlit, and uh, this is pretty pretty fun game. It's actually pretty addicting. I've been playing for about an hour and a half now, um, and just the building aspect of it is enough for me to buy it. So thanks, guys, for watching. If you want to see more, let me know by leaving a like and comment down below. I'll do some more pirate battles. We'll build, build better ships. I'll learn how to build better ships. I'll build something that's a little bit more pleasing to the eyes. So yeah, thanks, guys, for watching, and remember to keep having fun. Bye-bye.